Hey Blake, so you know you were the star of our last video, and uh, that that basically was talking about using a uh, a mask with a an extension tube uh, attached to your standard nebulizing, nebulizing yeah your standard so, nebulizing stuff and and but but we we realized so we went we went out and got a a spectrum of, of mask and then we realized that wait a minute what was the problem what was the problem so previously in our video we used we were incidentally not using the t piece that comes in the nebulizer equipment that comes in the standard bag with your nebulizer reservoir um, for your medication, your aerosolized reservoir, and your mouthpiece that we typically use. We were using a ventilator tee to adapt the setting, the whole setup, to a bag valve mask. Yeah, so what we did then, we got these other masks and we said, wait a minute, it's yeah. not connecting, show that. So we found out that when we wanted to use just the standard nebulizer equipment, that the tee piece for the nebulizers were not adapted to this side for the OD ID of the mask. Yeah. So they were, of course, they were designed to fit that. Yeah. So our respiratory therapist was wonderful and said, this is what you need. And he got these connectors that fit into that mouthpiece. Okay. And now you can assemble the entire thing. Okay, let's try all the other, all the and other sides. And incidentally, masks. They also fit the next size down. Yeah. As well as the neonatal sizes. Yeah. So. Well, you got one smaller here, don't you? That's the smallest one we got. Yeah, that's the. That's the. Here we go. Yeah. Same size. Yeah. So. Oh, same size. Same okay. size, but that's the, the. Incidentally, we found a solution that let us use the entire spectrum. So we, we are actually in the smaller. process. There is one smaller. Yeah. Okay. So let's see. And there it fits. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, on these, the, the larger size actually have the... These, um, I, I call them spider pieces. Yeah. For lack of a, so the larger sizes name. have these spider pieces that actually let you potentially make straps. Mm -hmm. And remember, we, we made the straps from... From tourniquet tubing. Tourniquet tubing, yeah. Okay, good. So... So, so, so the little you know, ones though is I don't theory, I don't you see could, you. But you see, could I don't, still do it. You could probably still do it's it. Still, but I, it's I still think not optimal, you're gonna but, have mom. You're gonna yeah. have someone holding on to that. I basically. think if the child is the, is this age or size, you're gonna have to hold the mask on. You're gonna have to have a staff member or a family member, caregiver holding that on. Yeah. Um, more for safety of the patient at that point. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So we we were we were stumped for a minute, but I but now we got the solution and and it's and it's these adapters so it's all good life is good yeah there you go all right thanks for being the <laughs> take two take two thanks Okay, so there's your viral filter. It's the viral filter. Yeah. There's my elastomer magma mask. See? Okay. Ran to that yeah, issue. you demonstrate how not to do it. Yep. Now you have your adapter. I don't know the name of that adapter. We probably ought to get that and we'll put that in the video. I want it was he had the metric size for the adapter. Okay. Is what the Lark was saying. Okay. Probably need to put a little more in it, but there we go. Now we're getting some smoke. There we go. There we go. Just need to turn up the wick a little bit. There we go. Got smoke. There we go. All right. Yep. Now, yep, breathe on it. See, see how it feels to breathe on it. Not bad. Okay, no resistance, no significant resistance. And you're breathing easily. 
I, I it's think, hard to talk and see all this right Yeah, now. yeah. But no, I, I, I do think that this will cut down significantly the amount of aerosol that goes out into the um, atmosphere from the patient, you know, as the patient's breathing in and out. Ooh. The main thing is you just have to keep that mask on the patient. And as we discussed, you could, well, on these larger masks, you can improvise uh, straps. Yeah. Or you, I well, let's let's grab a, the grab the straps. Grab grab a couple just just to yeah. end the show. This one's probably gonna smash my nose. Yeah, I mean, wait. I mean, you don't just just you don't have to put it on. Just oh, yeah. basically, just demonstrate how you're. I mean, I just pop them on. Pop it on there very nicely, and you're gonna put one above and one below, probably. Yeah. There we go. Wrap it around patient's head. The desired tension, and just pop it. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit more cal recalcitrant this day. Yeah. But, but when they're under tension, they hold. Yeah, they still hold. They, they still. have one above and one at the nape of the neck. Yeah.